This article comes to us courtesy of Evanex, which makes and sells aftermarket Tesla accessories. The opinions expressed therein are not necessarily our own at Inside EVs, nor have we been paid by Evanex to publish these articles. We find the company's perspective as an aftermarket supplier of Tesla accessories interesting and are happy to share its content free of charge. Enjoy! Posted on Evanex on April 28, 2022, by Charles Morris a slew of studies have found that electric vehicles produce much less pollution over their lifetimes than fossil-powered vehicles, no matter how many oil-financed social media posts claim the opposite. Above. A look at a Model 3 at a Tesla supercharger, Flickr. Marco Virch, however, generating the electricity to charge EVs is not emission-free and as millions more get hooked up to the grid, smart charging to maximize efficiency will be an important part of the picture. A recent report from two environmental nonprofits, the Rocky Mountain Institute and Watt Time, examined how scheduling charging for times of low emissions on the electrical grid can minimize EV emissions. According to the report, in the U.S. today, EVs deliver about 60 to 68 percent lower emissions than ICE vehicles, on average. When those EVs are optimized with smart charging to align with the lowest emissions rates on the electricity grid, they can reduce emissions by an additional 2 to 8 percent, and even become a grid resource. The researchers point out that, as more accurate models provide dynamic signals about the costs and emissions of power generation in real-time, there is a significant opportunity for utilities and drivers to control EV charging according to emission signals. This can not only reduce costs and emissions, but facilitate the transition to renewable energy. The report found two key factors that are critical to maximizing CO2 reduction. The local grid mix the more zero emissions generation available on a given grid, the greater the opportunity to reduce CO2. The highest possible savings found in the study were on grids with high levels of renewable gene. However, even relatively brown grids can benefit from emissions-optimized charging. Charging behavior. The report finds that EV drivers should charge using faster charging rates but over longer dwell times. The researchers listed several recommendations for utilities. When appropriate, prioritize level 2 charging with longer dwell times. Thanks for watching. Credits to insideevs.com. Please like my video and subscribe EVpedia for more electronic vehicle news and updates.